about done with this one. Um, it's got to touch up a couple bits. Um, the middle tail light over there, and then uh, there's a little section in between the chrome strip and the bumper that I have to touch up, and then this line, and then up here with the garage where I have to touch that up. But overall, it's pretty much done, and the license plate, I just need to touch up the B in the middle. But um, yeah, it's reading really cool. I really like how this is uh, this is coming out. I thought it looked cool with like, the lights off in here for some reason. So this is, how, this is my favorite like to work in favorite like setup with the lights off and I don't know you just get more contrast and it's so much fun so um I don't know it makes me like super uh creative or whatever so that's just kind of how I like to paint but um yeah sorry for the chair it's pretty bad <laughs> but um yeah I just thought I'd do a quick little narration on this one so like you can Kind of step in front of it, and then you can kind of go off to the side. So, I mean, I have some heads mirrors with uh, with painting on my on my hand here. So, this thing is freaking sick. But yeah, here I'll turn the lights on once. So you can kind of see, like with it both, kind of see what I'm doing. So it's so much more relaxing to render this way. I don't know. I just had a blast doing it. So. Yeah, this one's looking really cool. I just figured I'd start uh, posting more YouTube videos because uh, I don't do that a lot. So I figured it'd be kind of sweet just to show you, show you guys my uh, process with all this stuff, throw up some time lapses, throw up some just quick narration stuff of my artwork. Because this is always changing in here. So I have these next couple. That's kind of crap looking, but <laughs> I don't know. I like, I like working in a mess, I guess, as you could say. So. There's stuff everywhere. We've got paint all over the floor and yeah, this is my mixing setup. I just got a uh, this is just a glass window or something. I think I don't know what it's from, but it's just there's this tape. There was tape. <laughs> and I just taped it together and then I used the cardboard that it came with as the uh, as the, the backing behind this to mix on. It's like ten bucks to make that, so you got the trusty <laughs> Wires detail product, but there's water in here, so it sprays really good. Got to keep that paint nice and moist. So these things work awesome. These are like two bucks. They just scrape the paint. So yeah, and I just use cheap brushes. So <clears throat> gets the job done. Of course, it's like everything in here is just covered in paint. Um. Oh. But yeah, so I'm pretty hyped on this one. I like how smooth and like like easy it is to read, like how it came out. So it's going to my dad's friend. Um, he was really excited to book in on painting for me, so that made me want to do it even like render it even a little harder than what I normally do. So um, I'm also just trying to spend more time with not uh, trying to rush through these as fast. So um, as long as I get some type of time lapse footage from the beginning to the end. I think it should be alright. Um, just recording the whole thing would kind of suck, so... Yeah, this is pretty much done, but I have to just touch up a couple little... A noticeable little, like, bits on it, so... Yeah. I just thought I'd throw up a video. I just have a blast working with the projector, so... My friends are like, dude, I still don't know how you do that. I mean, it's just like looking at what you see, pretty much, is how I go about it, so... I mean, the projector I use, it's like super high quality, it's like 1080p or something. You know, I'm also like really interested with like photography and stuff too, so that's also why I'm like interested with using a projector to see how clear I can get some of this stuff to come out and like take out bits and like just kind of make it my own, so. Got to design it a bit. Those rock chips on the bumper were kind of sweet to kind of pull out. I would really want them to want it to pop right because you can detail it wrong and it looks kind of, kind of wonky looking, so. That license plate is quite the battle, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm trying to get that to read correctly. I have to fix the, the end there too a little bit, but uh, most but yeah, that's pretty much finished, so. That in the frame is gonna look really hot, so. Yeah. Uh, I might just use this as the end clip, so. Um, or I'll take another one, I'm not sure yet, but uh, yeah, I gotta get a haircut. 
it's gotten kind of long, so yeah. All right. Yeah, this might be the end clip, I think, because it, I mean, it looks pretty good. Like the stuff I'm gonna touch up, I don't think you guys are gonna notice, but uh, here I'll stand in front of it, but I'm good here. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's about it. Um, just figured I'd throw up a quick uh, little vlog on this one, so. All right, here's some uh, fo couple photos of it, and that's about it. All right, peace. Remember to uh, subscribe. Peace.